I wanted to let that lover relax. Are you going to come over here? Because she got all of the puppies. I know, right? No, I got no puppy. Mm. Hi, I'm Aquafina. I'm Jack Black, and you're watching BuzzFeed. Today, we are playing with puppies. I feel good near the loom be loo. Oh my God, it's happening. <gasps> oh, they're real. Yes. Oh, oh, I thought it was the blanket. Sorry, I can't have my glasses on. Oh. Yeah, hello, oh. deal. Oh. Oh, oh, my baby. Hello, dear. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Come here. That's a good girl. Oh. That's a good boy. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my. Oh. These oh. are mine now. <laughs> yeah. What a sweet petunia. I will oh. name you Roscoe. Wow. What kind of dogs do you think they're, that they're going to grow up to be? This looks like a Jack Russell Terrier, and this looks like a Baba Ganoush. You sweet sausage. Oh, what's up a deal? Oh, you got my finger. Does oh that taste God. good to you? I would be a big old ostrich with Reeboks on and I would go sailing away from my ex-husband. I think I would be a majestic eagle soaring in the breeze. I love that we think that we, we would choose birds. I think I'd like to be a mama dog of these sweet, sweet little munchkins. True. My fingers taste good. Does taste good. Well, I'm very excited to be in a movie with Viola Davis. She is an incredible actress. The truth is, okay, I never actually worked with her when we were filming, but I have seen her performance and she blows doors down. It's exciting to say that we're partying together on Kung Fu Panda 4. Oh, oh wow, yeah, that's a uh -oh, lot of pee uh -oh. there. There's a lot of pee pee there. But, that, oh, but you know what? <laughs> you guys are so cute that it's okay. Oh, I'm just impressed with how well behaved they are. It does seem like you have more love on your side. They came over. Oh, what's happening? Oh, 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 oh. Is there a little oh, battle? Over. Were you battling over my affections? Yeah, they were. They were. Oh, you come back. Yeah, come to Papa. Go hi, get my it. buddy. Hi. Go say hi to you yet. You're so this cute. one's big. That one's you know kind of I mean? big. Rotund. Their bladders are like nonstop. Well, it's important to stay hydrated. Yeah, and clearly they are. I actually got to let one loose too. <laughs> I liked working with you. I did like working with you. That was a good one. That was awesome, yeah. It was cool when we got to meet all of those artists, when we got a little sneak -a peek and we got to hang out and say hi to some of them, because yeah. that's the real magic of the movie are these incredible wizards uh, in the art department making these beautiful drawings and landscapes. It was cool to high five them. Wow! Wow! It's like gladiator times now. They're so playful. They are so playful. Oh, Snuffleupagus. Oh. Snuffleupagus. Oh, the big guy is coming around. Just a around. little bit of wrestling. And maybe a little nibble. They like a wrestle and a nibble. I actually do have some martial arts history. I did some karate when I was a child, and that's how I learned how to count to 10 in Japanese. Ichi ni san shi go roku ichi achi kuju. Wow, dude. Thank you. I also took some judo, and I know how to flip a person if, if need be. I know how to do a, a, a diving tiger roll in a pinch, and I did do a little kung fu, so truly I am a triple threat. Hello, you came back. Yeah. I thought you were gone forever. I thought you ran away from home, but then you came back to me. I love you. Man, this makes me just want a dog. I want to tell her that I love her a Do you get dog fever where, where like if you, when you're around dogs you, you like really need a dog now? Absolutely. I've got the doggy fever. What? And obviously they're potty trained. Oh. What happened there? Sorry, babe. Did she come falling down from a high mountain? <laughs> no one saw that. I'm all about creativity. When my boys want to explore any kind of music or filmmaking or creativity in any way, I'm fully supportive, 100%. Maybe to a fault, where it's like, oh, you're staying up later than you should because you're playing drums in the basement, or you're maybe focusing too much on the short films or whatever. Mm. I'm like, go for it, go crazy. Yes, obsess on that thing, because that's kind of where I'm from, too. I like to go nuts on the creativity. Yeah. Jack definitely has made me break character before. <laughs> Sandra O oh a little bit. I just worked with her. She made she made me break character. Honestly, I, I break character a lot. If you're funny enough, Jack definitely. Feelings mute. We had fun horsing around on this one when we worked together on Kung Fu Panda. We did most of it in isolation. That's the way the big animations usually do it, but we did get to jam on a couple scenes together and that was yeah. really fun. Yeah. The love and joy of the crew. <laughs> 
<laughs> you don't sneak away with something from the set? No, no that's props. stealing. <laughs> I did. I have stolen. I kept the guitar that I played in School of Rock. Uh, oh, oh. But that, was, that wasn't actually stealing. I actually bought that because I knew at the end of doing this movie, I'm going to want to keep the guitar, so I'm going to buy the guitar in advance. Right. You better believe I kept that prop. I feel like I took some, I had some hay in one of my pockets. I think it was Shang-Chi or something. <laughs> some yeah. hay in there. I'm going to take one of these props home. I know. It's giving like Melissa McCarthy and Bridesmaids. This one I just had powerful eye contact with. Did you look at my soul just now? No, he just needed to poo. I like to unwind with a little bit of Xbox. Jump in, see what's up with my uh, Fallout 3. I like a little mindless video game and just to, to wind down. Me and my boys like to watch a movie. We just watched uh, uh, Godfather. They had not seen Godfather. I felt like they're old enough now. You gotta be of a certain age. Just a lot of, mm -hmm. a lot of mafioso mm -hmm. bad stuff happening. I haven't seen it. I like to wind down with a little uh, froyo. I like to come home and maybe read a little, run a bath. Really? Yeah. What are you reading? I'm reading Kafka, Kafka's short stories. Really? Do you really read or do you listen? I read it. There's like this like bookstore that I've been going to. It's been a strike, you know. I only listen to books. Does that count as reading? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. That was a long pause before you said yeah. Well, yeah, because you're still you're still garnering information. I'll take a test. I'll listen to Kafka, and then you read the Kafka, and we'll see who remembers more. I like my my mind's voice. I wonder who reads the Kafka if there even is an audiobook of Kafka. Who would be the best reader of Kafka's Metamorphosis? Oh, you sweet petunia. So cute. Natasha Leone. I bet she get she slides in some good DMs. I DM'd you that one time when you predicted the end of the writer's strike. Right. You predicted it down to the day. I DM'd you, I was like, how did you know? <laughs> and you were very cryptic. You were like, I'm just uh, reading the tea leaves. I don't remember what you said. I slid into Jason Momoa's DMs because oh. we're going to party on uh, a movie. Hell and, yeah, uh, nice. I was like, sup, bro? See you soon. Are you going to come over here? Because she got all of the puppies. I know, right? Now I got no puppy. Oh, and Jack, Jack needs some company. Oh, it doesn't seem right when you have to carry him over. Hey, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 go do. Oh. I'm really psyched to work with Jared again. That was like my main reason I wanted to party with them. And also Jason Momoa. It's just like a exciting adventure I'm looking forward to in New Zealand, where I had some fun experiences on King Kong way back in the day. I like the aspect of, you know, you can pull up in whatever, wear whatever shoes. In PJs? In PJs, like Don't a voice eat that piece work, of, you know? Oh, look, he got a piece of- What's that? He got like a piece of- You got gaffer tape help, on help, there? Help me, Aquafina. Oh, oh. He got it stuck on his paw. Oh, no. You see, he got stuck in it. Oh. But, Are you pee? You can't tell. Puppies are always in a peace pee pee, -pee stance. They're always in a peaceful pee pee place. They're always- <laughs> Yeah. There's one right behind you in your oh, lower yeah. lumbar. What are you thinking about, honey? It seems like he's nervous and he wants his mama. Oh, well that would be me oh, because they're adoptable. He found a nice little nook and cranny. Oh, he's so, oh, so cute. I love what that you live me? in my lumbar what? now. Being around the dogs, it's like my mind is like being filled with like oxytocin and so I can't like think. Mm. Okay, okay, this one got terrified of me when I was laying out again. I think I look like a big terrifying dog with my big furry face. Uh, he backed scared. away from me slowly. Oh, he's fully facing that way, dude. My best dish, I don't want to brag, I make a cheeseburger burrito that's unbelievable. I crumble the beef and uh, put it in a tortilla, but I like to eat the tortilla right on the flame. Flip, flip, flip. A little bit of cheese, a little bit of ketchup, a little bit of mayo, a squirt of mayo. I wrap it up. Mm -mm. Mm. I call it the cheeseburger burrito. That sounds delicious, Jack. It's pretty make, darn good. You should make that at some point for the crew and the dogs. All right, I'm gonna need a lot of tortillas. I've never been to Iceland. Really? Yeah, that's on my bucket. Have you been? Yes. Is it crazy? It's so beautiful, dude. It's what like is amazing. It? What do you mean? It looks like another planet, the photos I've seen. It's such beautiful, like the northern lights. You saw northern lights? I did see. Oh, Lucky. Peaks of that. Did you? Oh, that sounded like a kitty cat. It was so high pitched. Did you see Bjork? Did not see Bjork in Iceland. Is that what you wanted? Well, that's it's a famous thing about Iceland is it's the land of Bjorks. Right. And fjords. And well. fjords. Basically, everything that Philip Seymour Hoffman got is a role that I auditioned for and didn't get. No hard feelings. Wow. 
one. Ooh, ooh, Aww. ooh. You landed on your feet though, you're spry. You're the spry one. Here's how good Philip Seymour Hoffman was though. I would go on these auditions, I was like, I can't see how this is gonna work. Good luck whoever gets this part. And then I would see the movie and go, holy crap, that's how you're supposed to do that part. It makes so much sense now. Philip Seymour Hoffman. I really liked the movie Catfish. Great documentary. There's a, there's a puppy sleeping on your crotch. Yeah, he's been sleeping. Wish I had some Scooby snacks to make them love me more. Give this one a Scooby snack so quick. Dude. All the time. It's like 13 <laughs> seconds ago. Constantly. 13 seconds ago you were. It's just from, it's my life is a constant string of embarrassments, but I've learned to embrace them because I know that's where the magic is. I had to pee the other Bradley and I went into, like it was like a long line and I guess women were using the men's room and when I came out I just saw, I saw like a dude <laughs> waiting. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was like, I know this isn't my room. Kevin from Home Alone, because I loved all the food that he ate. He ate like incredible food when his parents were away. Probably Tom Cruise when he rode off that mountain on his motorcycle. I always make fun of him for doing his own stunts, but I secretly wish I did my own stunts. You know the one I'm talking about where he like rode the motorcycle off the mountain and then he's just like <sighs> skin suits it for a while. <gasps> you mean he's naked? Royce. No, not skin suit. I meant <laughs> what I meant. That would be a cool stunt though. <laughs> You gotta pay extra for that shot. Uh, Tom Cruise, uh, talk for a minute. <laughs> cut, cut. We'd like to try it one more time. But this time, how would you feel about going full skin suit? Golf sacks. <laughs> comma. Wait There's a, a comma second. <laughs> Golf sacks. There's a comma. <laughs> it's funny when you put those two together. If you're golfing and then blowing a, <laughs> it's a like massive that sport solo. where you shoot and ski. Three iron. Soprano sax. <laughs> I've only ever had one other job other than acting and music, and it was a telemarketing. You'd think that I'd be good at it because I could use all of my acting skills, and I wasn't good at it. And the person right next to me was killing it, making tons of sales. I didn't understand why, when I put on my charm offensive, I should be selling these whale song sounds or whatever we were selling at the time. What? There was something about, he was just like, sort of just talking in a droning on a monotone, and people were buying it and I think it's because even though it sounded monotonous and hypnotic, there was something just honest about it. Have you had any non-creative jobs? I would have had a bevy of non-creative jobs, yeah. Oh, yeah. Working in a family, friends, personal real estate office, whatever that means, even that was okay. But I was like, what am I doing, you know? She's very nice though, Nancy. Dude, three out of the four dogs are a totally snooze. I know, do you want one? No, no, no. Okay, cool. I would want to live probably be in the end of Ocean's Eight or Crazy Rich Asians. Hi. It would be cool to live in the Valley of Peace. Kung Fu Panda, the Valley of Peace. Mm -hmm. Be pretty rad to live in um, King Kong land. Those are my answers. I'll try anything once. Be cool to do a straight up musical where it's just nonstop singing. Wow. I'm dancing. Oh. Never done one of those. Just like a musical, like, you know, Chicago or... Uh, Grease. Grease. That'd be amazing. Cool. I got chills. They're multiplying. And I'm losing control. Cause the power you're supplying. It's like an audition now. I could do it, you guys. It's electrifying. You're right. They're oh my God, they're yes. sleeping in a pile. Yes, they made a yin and yang back here. Thanks, BuzzFeed. You can actually adopt all of these dogs at pupculturerescue.org. Make sure to watch Kung Fu Panda 4. Oh, bye guys. <laughs>